Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a home empties video. If you have not seen home empties for me in the past, it's where I share with you products, cleaning, hubby related, baby related, candle related, things that I use around the home, my husband uses and my son uses or I use with my son. So if you're interested in more beauty related content with lotions, makeup, skincare that I personally use, I have beauty empties that I do. So I'll link my latest one down below for you guys who are interested and check out the playlist if you are interested as well. But if you love bath and body work stuff and cleaning items, things for your home, this is the video for you. So let's get into it. I kind of just throw everything into a big bag. So we're just going to pull out things at random. So we're going to start off. I have a hand soap here from Bath and Body Works. This is the Bath and Body Works Iced Gingerbread. And I was definitely a fan of this scent. It is, what is it? What is it? Oh, come on. Homemade gingerbread, brown sugar, and vanilla extract. I am a huge fan of Bath and Body Works hand soaps. I've tried to go off and do Method and what other ones have I used? The Mrs. Myers hand soaps, things like that. We always continue to go back to these. I like the variety of the scents. I also like the seasonal scents, things like that. But this is a pretty good scent for the Christmas time. I think it's more of a seasonal scent, so it may not be out now, but we did enjoy that. I use the seventh generation. These are the dishwasher detergent packs. It's just so easy to throw this into your dishwasher, not have to measure anything out, and it keeps our dishes clean. So I continue to get this. A lot of my cleaning products I get from The Grove or Target. The Grove is an online site where you can put in like a subscription and pick out the items that you like. A lot of them are more natural. Um, not all of them are like super natural ingredients, but there are some really good brands there. And I do find that they are relatively cheaper, especially than the grocery stores. Target's a hit and miss, but you can submit like a price change and they will like accept the cheaper price. So check that out if you're interested. Another cleaning item I get from the Grove a lot are the Mrs. Myers dish soaps. This scent is Bluebell. This is one of their scents they have all year round and this is my go-to for whenever they don't have the peppermint or the apple one in the fall time. So you'll see this scent a lot. I use this every day to hand wash my dishes and it smells great and can't say anything better but it is a great dish soap. I have a candle here. This is Bath and Body Works Vanilla Snowflake Candle and we definitely love the vanilla scents. Oh, this one smelled so good. It was frozen vanilla, iced fur needles, mint leaf, and coconut flakes. So this was perfect for me and my husband. He loves more of like the woodsy, like Christmas tree scents and I'm more of the sweet vanilla, sugary, like fruity kind of scents. And so this was a good mix for that, his preferences and my preferences. So we'll definitely check out this scent closer to Christmas time when that comes out. If I can find any of these products, I'll link them down below for you guys who are interested. A baby related product is from Baby Gannix. This is the bubble bath fragrance free. My son loves this. This is one of the things I also always have in my Grove order once a month. And so, so awesome. It makes really good bubbles. I love that it's fragrance free. I used to do like Bath and Body Works shower gels and use that as a bubble bath. But for my son, I think that might be a little too overpowering in the scent department, especially with my taste and scents. But this has been perfect. We've really enjoyed it and we continue to buy it. I have a stain remover. This is Shout Triple Acting. I've tried the Clorox version. I've tried another one like Klingon or something like that. The Shout one works the best in my opinion for getting out any of those random food stains, stains out of your clothes. When he was an infant and he would have accidents or, you know, diaper explosions, things like that, I would use Shout and it would do a really good job at getting that stain out. So highly recommend y'all pick out Shout if you haven't tried it already. A uh, hubby product, he uses the Head & Shoulders Dandruff sh Shampoo and Conditioner 2-in-1. He loves the 2-in-1. It's just easy for him to just wash his hair once and rinse it off kind of thing. He always gets the classic clean scent. I don't think I've seen any other kind of scents, but definitely a product my husband loves and we always repurchase. 
Okay, so I actually have, and I didn't finish both of these at the same time. I have two different Tide detergents. So we used to buy the Tide Clean Breeze detergent. Then I had a son and I wanted something a little bit more natural, less fragrance. So we've been purchasing, let me switch these around. The Tide Free and Gentle. Um, I also buy the HE kind because we now have a high efficiency washer. And so I love using this. I constantly have one of these I'm working on and then one of them in the backup. So easy. I love it. It cleans their clothes pretty well. So I recommend you all check it out if you haven't. Another candle here. This is from Candles by Victoria and this is their cinnamon bun scent. Now, I heard a lot about Candles by Victoria here on YouTube. I kind of wasn't that amazed by it. The cinnamon buns actually smelled really good, but I've tried a couple of other ones and I wasn't such a fan of it. I think the issue for me is I, I need something like Bath & Body Works where I can smell it. These are handmade and really cute. They have some really neat designs if you want the bigger candles, um, but I feel like I would have to really love the candle scent for that. But this one is good. I highly recommend the cinnamon buns. I think I tried the linen or the cotton laundry linen. That was too strong for me. So again, I like the sugary scents. This one was really good, but I don't recommend that laundry scent. Don't have it with me. I think I actually gave it to my parents to try and just declutter that one. I have from Finish, this is the dry, Jet Dry. It dries dishes, prevents spots. My dishwasher like always wants this in its cycle kind of thing. I don't put like a whole bunch of it all the time. Probably like once a month I have to refill it. But this does do a good job. I do notice when it's empty and I run the dishwasher versus this. It definitely dries the dishes a lot faster. It's not like wet and has all those like droplets all over it. So I recommend this if your dishwasher like has a spot for it. I don't know where... There's just like a dispenser for my dishwasher. I don't know about everyone's dishwashers. Check it out if you do have a spot for it other than detergent. It's like a rinse dry or something and get this kind, it's perfect. Another hand soap here, this is Bath & Body Works Sparkling Icicles. And it says it is sparkling citrus, golden sandalwood, and bergamot. We always purchase this scent for hand wash in the winter time. We love it. It's one of those clean fragrances, but also like has that winter vibe to it, if you know what I mean. So check that one out. My hubby has a shower gel in here. This is the fresh water. So he goes between freshwater, ocean, and I just bought him at Lantic. He doesn't have a preference, I don't think. He just likes the water kind of scents. He doesn't like the noir, and there's a brown one. If Y'all know what I'm talking about. He doesn't like those, so these are kind of his go-to. He wants these over any other kind of shower gel. I try like to get like, he used to get the Old Spice, and what's the other manly brand at Target and stuff like that. But he prefers this, so I will continue to do it because then that means I get some body soaps myself. So it's just a nice little rotation there. Contact solution, we use BioTrue. This is just the best one. It's the one our eye doctors recommend, so we always use BioTrue. Another hand soap here, this is the Snow Kissed Citrus. And we really liked this for, of course, the citrus vibe with the it's sugared mint, frozen verbena, and lemon zest. We just, these are perfect for kitchen and the bathroom. So highly recommend all of their lemon scents, but especially the snow kissed ones. It's just a nice, like lighter scent of lemon. Then always vanilla bean Noel. This is a go-to for everybody in Bath & Body Works land, and we highly love the hand soaps. I don't go for the body products anymore. I just kind of prefer it in a hand soap, and I've noticed too the candle version of the Vanilla Bean Noel isn't as strong as some of their other vanilla scents, so I kind of stay away from that and just slowly go for the hand soaps. It is Vanilla Bean, Warm Caramel, and Sugar Cookies. I mean, come on. I have a, another baby product here. This is the Earth Mama baby sweet orange baby wash. And I seriously love this stuff for my son. I like the natural ingredients of it and I love that it is a foaming like body wash for him. So he has such a fun time. I now like I'll spray and like get him all clean and then he wants to get himself clean and likes me to put it on the little washcloth, dab himself, clean himself that way. So I love it. I love the pump. I love the smell of this. 
can't say enough good things about this product. Check it out if you have little ones. And then I have another hand soap here. This is the Bath & Body Works Afternoon Apple Picking. I am a big apple fan from Bath & Body Works in the fall time, but I continue to use my hand soaps regardless if it's the season or not. I know, crazy, right? But this is a really a good one. What is this scent? Crisp apple, succulent pears, and cinnamon. So that is everything for this home empties. I will leave a Bath Body Works video down below for you guys who are interested. I just did a spring haul. And then another video here for anything else you may be wanting to see from me. I hope to see you in my next video. Talk to you guys later. Bye.